think you deserve a well-earned vacation. Oh. So we will head in a video game right. to the Austrian Alps. Ooh. The mountains of the Austria. Alps. Yes. So not quite Swiss, but it's very close. It's in that same region there. Very Swiss. So we will go on an adventure here in a very somewhat Legend of Zelda type fashion. Okay. So that's the plan in Dungeons of Hinterberg on the show today. We want to pump you up. I'm getting pumped. Pumped. Today. So yes, today to the Alps on vacation. The apples. And in this vacation, in this region of the Austrian Alps, the only place in the world that has actual, real magic. Wait, there's real magic? I mean, in the game. Oh. So, in the game world, like, in their reality, magic only exists in the Austrian Alps. And so there are 25 dungeons to complete in a 3D Zelda style of a game. You said Zelda, but to me it looks like Fortnite. It's not Fortnite. I, I know, it's very art style, very cartoony, very what is, cell shady. Why does every game have to look like Fortnite? Look, man, it made a lot of money. Right? It's still making a lot of money. There is a time system here where things can happen on di different days in you know the morning and the noon and the night. So that's going to advance time. And you have four social stats. Renown, relaxing, familiarity, and amusement is one of your stats. Am I here so, for your amusement? Are you amused is one of the things that you can be in terms of your social well, stats. If we ate those mushrooms, we'd be really Well, good. yes. This does have combat. So X is a chop. Whoa. Y is a heavy chop. And you have magic on the bumpers here, right? So... She just looks like a normal girl. She doesn't look like she's ready to do some chops. That's the whole point, is that you're in a regular world on vacation to chop monsters and solve dungeons. Getting out of the corporate environment, <laughs> heading into the wilderness, and, you know, adventuring. Every once in a while, I just want to see a movie where it's like, the girl gets out into the wilderness and is going to go on an adventure, and then she dies immediately. Well, you know, that, that could definitely happen. And then it turns into a search and rescue movie. Sure. Right bumper here is your wind magic to shoot that way, and the left bumper here is a tornado, which can be controlled and also can pick you up. Oh, um, this is and really And do some dumb. of this, you know. I already for, hate this. For puzzles. For puzzles. Why is there puzzles in Fortnite? No, it's... Think... Ocarina of Time, Majora's Mask, Wind Waker, all the 3D Zeldas before Breath of the Wild. So that whole range of, hey, guess what? Dungeons, puzzles to solve, and enemies to chop. Boring. So complicated to make a 3D puzzle. Yeah. It's not easy. So. It's also not worth it. Well. Because it's too stupid. Debatable. Definitely debatable as you climb the ancient tree. So far, not one puzzle, but hey, we're, we're, we're climbing. It's, it's a big tree. Just keep on. How old is this character supposed to be? It's in her 20s, I think. Okay. Not a child? No. You're not a little kid, no. Now, much like those 3D Zelda games, there's no jump button. I know. Get out of my house. I'm not getting out of your house. I, I just... I went to go jump and it did not yeah, jump. No, see, here's the first thing, right? Here's this bridge. Why would this dumb not have a jump button? Same reason that Link didn't have one for 20 years. Right? Not to Breath of the Wild. There was, there was no jump button in Ocarina, Majora, Wind Waker. None of those had jump. I never played those. There was an auto jump when you go to a ledge and you just do it automatically, but and, no and manual jump button in, in those games. And you do remember that I never played those games. Well, look, Because there was no jump. So here's our wind, right? You see that thing over there? Yeah. Shoot the wind, and it moves the bridge. Oh, wow. And so if you want to get those items there, you do it again. Oh, I don't care. And we collect these items. <laughs> HBs are money, so we need that paper. Now, over here, again, we do this, and then guess what? We And we do it again. We And go look what a ladder. Oh, I hate this. Yeah, it's... uh. You know. It's, terrible, yeah. It's, it's one of those. <laughs> it's no, terrible, It's yeah. doing... Okay, that's... Is important. this new? Did this just come yes, out? Yes, this is out on, on Xbox. I think it's on... Are people going to like this? Is this going to be a hit? Because I feel it's going to be a flop. It just came out. I couldn't say. You can't but even jump. There is definitely a, um, a demand for a game in this style. Because they don't make a lot of them. 
again, now that they changed Zelda, where it doesn't really have the usual old school dungeons, people want that. They're not giving me me dungeons. Exactly. Okay, now we fight these oh, no. spiders. We can dodge with B, we can chop, and do that whole, you know. There are spiders. Chubby, chubby. Got monster tooth here. And eventually, but my things fill on that. I like lower... the way his jaw goes flying. Just the whole head just flies off. <laughs> Wait, Co now he's a robot. Kobolds are here to fight. Squished them. They're not even trying to fight. They just try to run, and then you kill them because you're a monster. Well, we're on vacation, so. It's like let let me sleep in my own home. And yeah. You're like, no, you're dead. Yeah, no, I'm I'm invading your dungeon here, bro. Yeah, you're the monster. Um, Those dudes are just chilling, minding their business in their own dungeon. Right, now we shoot this thing here. They're not here. trying to take over the world or anything. Magic exists and we're here to, I guess... Steal it? Wreck shop. Yeah, steal yeah, it. Yeah, ruin it? Uh-huh. You know. Colonize? Do what people do, yes. Yeah, yeah, do what humans do. Yes. Ruin everything. Uh-huh. There is climbing. It's very simple. It's I hit A, and then I hit it again. And then I hit it again. It's not very uh, complex in terms of how they climb. Hey man, look for the prompt. You can't really fall here, so uh -huh. there's no real danger in that. And then you hit D to drop, like that. And you've done things. Drop. And you've done things. So. All right, let's play something out. So here, you you see how there's a gap there? If we just run toward it, guess what? You're not gonna jump. We jump. I told you, it's an auto jump, like Zelda used to be, before it had a jump button. Why would you not give the f character a jump button if there's a jump? I do not know. God, is, that's frustrating. What is this plant? Can I chop this plant? Can I shoot this plant? Oh, I can... All right. Are they, are they, are, are they bombs? What's going to happen here? Yes. All right. So we grab this with our wind power. And we aim up here. And we explode it. And I guess that clears the path for us. So, sure. Jump. I know two. Arnold and Gunther. That's <laughs> it. All I know. So it's like, you really can't make this, it's, it's, it's not. So what you're trying to say is people from the Alps are big, buzzly, tough guys. Maybe. Um, They're going to pop you up. up. Um, but I was going to say, like, I came in here ready to be like, all right, all of the usual uh, Swedish chef stuff. But it's, it's, but it's not Switzerland. So, you know, it's, it's close. It's nearby, but it's not the same. Exactly. Not quite the same thing. Meatballs and whatnot, you know. Yeah, I want some Swedish meatballs. Yeah, I know. Let's get that DoorDash fired up. Good stuff. The question is, I already know your answer. Is that chest over there worth going to get? I don't know. What, what's the cup size? Let's go touch the chest. <laughs> oh, this kind yes, of chest. Yes, a sword. Now, is that sword better than what we already have no. as our sword? Maybe. So we have currently the Sawtooth V2. Oh, hi. Hi, everybody. What does this do? Oh, sh that did that. News to me. Uh, how about come back down? Perhaps I need you? I don't I don't have a thing, though. I don't have a, uh, whatchamacallit, a, um... Trash. <laughs> Why is there trash to pick up? What kind of game is this? Uh-huh thing to do. Oh, is it just jump down? Yes. Take damage. Jump down. Because now let's go back over here. And this was, there There was a lot of this in those older games that it did was. this. Of just, alright, now, now you backtrack and get the object you need to go solve a puzzle to do that kind of thing. It's so frustrating. So you grab this over here and shoot it way up there. I hope it reaches. You know what I would rather do? There we go. Like literally anything a else. Anything else, yeah. <laughs> literally. Checkpoint. Discovered. <laughs> we can save the game. Oh, the checkpoint. oh, oh, hallelujah. Save slot. Wow. Game's being saved. There are parts where you will see a warning sign for enemies. And all right, it says, hey, man, maybe don't go here. And that's usually a pretty good warning of, hey, don't, because you're going to die. <laughs> Because you're gonna just, if you go over there and, tr like, you could try to fight them. Like, you just the option to do that. But, it's like, hey, man, there are there are signs for a reason. <laughs> so, perhaps read them and, uh, okay. So, 
What do you think is going to happen here with these brambles? They're going to try to, those vines are going to come up and try to grab your ankles, probably. How do you think we get over these fuck? These, well, you can't f jump! These brambles. So, so how do you think people would do that? A parachute? What did I already show you? I don't know. A tornado. Oh, I really hate you. And now. it carries you over the brambles. Even worse. So your feet don't get spiked and whatnot. Dumbest idea of all time. Look, man. And there we go. Look at that. We're going to make a realistic adventure game. It's not. Where you ride on a tornado. It's magic. Magic is real in the Alps of Austria. Get out of my house. <laughs> I'm just telling you what's in the game. And then we climb. Climb some more. We were just here. We did this already. No, we did. This is a different area. Oh. But also, I have the option now to hit bumper and hit this. Sorry, this one? No, it's, uh... <laughs> it doesn't work. There it is. The spinny thing. Yeah. There we go. I don't know. Look, Look at that. that. Wow. Where's it? Oh, it's right here. All right. So, we grab this. And... What the... F oh, f Ah, uh, you got the poison. It's the bramble. I walked right into them. I didn't even see them. I was like, oh, I just go over here. <laughs> nope. They killed you. Can I not get them from... Bro, it's right there. Is the magic that sh That I can't just... You gotta chop them. You can't chop the bramble. Like, with how? Explain how. It doesn't work. You gotta figure it out. It's a puzzle. That's the well, excitement of yes. the video game, slug. Now so, you have to sit here and figure out how to do it. I think... I would say, oh, I don't in care. In my opinion, if we do this, like that, and then go over here with that... I feel like that might explode. Yeah. Look at that. My brain, I thought about it for a half second, and then I solved it. And you just cheated. H how do you cheat? <laughs> the magic is part of the game. That's, that's, that's part of the whole experience. <laughs> it's your magical powers. Ooh, magical powers. Yes, I know. It's wunderbar. If, if, if they really had magical powers, you would just fast forward to the end of the game and win. Well... That's not part of the adventure, though. You have to adventure. Adventure is exhausting. Well, yes. I that, have, I'm not going to argue that. I got other things to do. Personally, I'll stay home. But yeah, right. I got other things to do. How do I? Like naps to take. Yes, that's also very important. I'm old now. Wait, do we just do this? How do I get it over there? You got to drop through there. Drop it through. I did that. Look, it goes. How did it work when you said it? Now you did it before it didn't do anything. <laughs> How does that work? Okay. Exploded. And loaded. And now carry me up here. Hooray. Oh, look, and they grow right back. Yes. It's it looks a, just like real fruit. It's a magic plant. What is going on on this side? What? There's like, you just do this and run around and try to figure out how to get places. Yes, that's how the old things in Zelda worked. I just f***ed up. I just... I just, hold on, hold on, okay, okay, I was like, I'm stuck out here, I can't stuck. jump, oh, <laughs> that would have been bad. That would have been real bad, and imagine that a jump button. Yeah, that, 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 that would solve the whole problem, right? Yeah, God forbid. Okay, does this thing keep turning? No, it only goes in two directions. So you gotta go blow those ones up. But I can't get to the bombs, they're over there. Oh, alright, well, I guess we could just do something. <laughs> I mean... You're not wrong. <laughs> Birdhouse. You gotta send the tornado through that gate. Oh, yeah, yeah. See? You're getting it. You're getting it. If I had the thing down over here and send it through the gate, see? Look at that. He can use his brain occasionally <laughs> to solve gaming problems. We control that. But then what? You got halfway there. Throw it. You can't throw it. I can do that and then... Alright, so if I leave it on the edge and then... Turn it. Turn it, yeah. Alright. So... God, that's annoying. We'll grab a couple of them here. And then put them right here. And then shoot this thing. You shoot! Boom! Ah. Look at that. So smart. Oh, no! Not again! <laughs> Why can't I walk to... Ah! Hey. Now you're gonna have to do it again. <sighs> you're right, I am. <laughs> Walk over here carefully. Jesus. Okay. Pull it up. Then we run over this way. We stand, we shoot, we shoot. And you did it. And we did it. 
and we climb. Yay! It's, it's saving the game. So, how much farther can we have to really go here? If it's saving, I'd give this uh, thirty-seven non-assing jumps down. Non-assing jumps. Yeah. Uh. Oh hi. Or non-jumping asses. Even. The non-assing jump sounds weirder. Yeah, it does. And now a guy with a big stick wants to fight us. Uh, yeah, I know. Do we care? Not really. And then we open a chest for a, th a, th a thousand dollars for that. Hang him high. Whee! I thought those were the gallows. No. We're still going up this tree, and I would hope after the ladder that we're done. And, and if we're not, then we're still done. There's going to be a whole another adventure up there. I, I see mean, it. I see it coming. Possibly. I see it. No, that's the exit door. Oh, whoa. And a boss. Yeah, but you're gonna have to fight a f guy. Yeah. Well, yes. Of course I would. Why would not? Fight the boss. Yep. It's the final boss. Deal with this choppy. F and you dropped poison on me. Not great. I'm not gonna cheat for that. All right, gremlins. So you can't get through the door without killing him. Yep. That's. It's a. Come on, man. Video games. That's it. You're out of stamina. Heal up. Shut up, stop. Deal with that. So, having a skill that knocks guys over does not warp enough legs. Yeah. So, the lack of legs is a problem. A couple more gremlins. Yeah. I don't like your face. Uh, okay. Bila. You won. First, we get a chest. Body armor. Then... We get our stamp. Say, hey, we finished a dungeon. Yay. We get a stamp. We're on vacation. So, like having a, a postcard, you know? That kind of thing. We did five dungeons. The door opens. It's time to go. And we say, peace out, monsters. I'm going to go back to my ho hotel and watch TV. <laughs> on vacation. No. Oh, Let's have another adventure. The goo. Well, again, there's like 20 more dungeons, so for your amusement. The dungeons of Hinterburg. And now it goes to the evening. And so now here's the part of the game where you're being social. And there are folks to talk to and forge bonds and, you know, that kind of thing. Mm -hmm. We're not going to do that. The Barnerhof. But Welcome, there's, Slayers. there's a whole town here. It's right? like Pokemon Go. Yeah. Welcome, Slayers. What's up? So, yes, a whole, like, idyllic little city here, which has a map. And you can go talk to people like, say, Kai or Sam. And how that works is that spending time with them unlocks more perks for your character to fight the monsters in the dungeons. He's mostly a German Shepherd. Mostly. So, He's yeah, so you can dog get him. dodge stamina increase and we can Kurt get, Henning. you know, a Henning. I, I, I have not met Henning yet. I'm not sure if he's perfect. I've, I've, I have no idea. So, that is Dungeons of Hinterburg out now. You said it was 37 non-asses or something like that? 37 non-asses up. Up or down? I mean, wait. <laughs> wait I mean, 37 non-jumping asses down. Right, yes. Okay, that was, that was the rating. Anyhow, next week, uh, we have, instead of a platformer, we have a slap-former. Fat-former. Slap-former. Where your only buttons are jump and slap. So tune in for that next week on the show. Thug to me, thug to him. We'll see you then, and we're out.